guys, this is Mike X Gamer here, and we're gonna play Finance with the Krusty Krab today. This is a Five Nights at Freddy's game fan game based off of SpongeBob, and um, we're gonna start a new game. A newspaper article? Huh. Phone call? Uh, hello? Uh, hello, hello? Oh, hey! Welcome to your new job at the brand new Krusty Krab restaurant. Uh, so I'm the manager of this store, and I've been given a list of instructions to help you get settled into your new and exciting career with us. We're very glad to have you on board here. So uh, first off, welcome to the new Krusty Krab. Uh, you may be familiar with some of the older restaurants oh. in the chain, notably the original store as well as the Krusty Krab 2. Yeah. Uh, but this is a brand new Fun store, movie. and as you can tell, in a brand new location. Uh, as you already know, I am the manager here, uh, appointed by Mr. Krabs himself, to be honest. Uh, wow. and I've selected you as the night watchman here. That means it's your job to watch over the place, as well as the other employees for me. Okay. Uh, oh yeah. I should probably let you know, uh, instead of me hiring a brand new crew, uh, Mr. Krabs simply staffed the kitchen here with animatronic replicas of his old employees and neighbors. Wow. Krabs isn't known to be the most trusting person, especially with his money and secret recipe. So, yeah, I guess it exactly. does make a bit of sense. Anyway, speaking of valuables, they're located in a safe behind you, so it's your job to lock down the office in case you see any intruders. You can do this by closing the blast doors on either side of the room. Yeah. Just bear in mind that at night, we switch over to a backup generator with a limited supply of power. Closing those blast doors, as well as using any other electrical equipment, will increase the strain on that generator. If you use too much, the restaurant will go dark and you'll be completely vulnerable. Yeah. One last thing, if you notice any electrical equipment acting up, I like uh, lights this. flickering like or something, uh, the most likely cause is the animatronics. Uh, they've been designed to draw power from an outside source to save on their own energy costs. So if you notice the office lights flashing, then it, it probably just means they've wandered up onto the landing out the front of you. I, I wouldn't worry that's too much about it. Yeah. Anyway, that's enough for me. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good luck and have a good night. This guy is like a complete liar. I, I, I don't know... I don't know the map layout. Supply cabinet? It's Sandy, what's Sandy doing there? What's this too? Oh, we'll find out later. Alright, there's Spongebob. He's doing his thing on the grill. Um... Is there anything else I can click on? Whoa! Oh, that's cool. It's a flashlight? Huh, that's so cool. That's so cool. Alright. Let's check the doors. Nobody there. Nobody there. Uh oh. Patrick moved. Where'd he go? Where he at, though? Oh, SpongeBob moves as well. Nobody there. Nobody in front of me? No. I don't care why the flashlight's here, I don't care why the... Um, I see Squidward, he's moving, he's... Oh, Spongebob moves from the grill. This music. Oh, come on. Where anybody is, I don't know where I am. It says I'm in the middle, but where do they come from? That's what I'm asking. Nobody's on the cameras. Ah, oh, what the heck, man? Nobody. I don't get this. I don't, I don't get it at all. Okay, I see Spongebob in the back. Where's Patrick? I can't find Patrick at all. 
I'm guessing Sandy's like Foxy. Oh, there's Patrick. Okay. I don't know what. I don't know where I am. Like, I don't get this map layout. This it just shows like cameras and this doesn't even show any doorways to me. Like I can't even find anyone. Uh, find anyone or where they're going or. She looks SpongeBob. He just went back there. And I don't know. Anybody at my doors? No. Why is my flashlight always on? I don't get this. Might be a bug in the game. I don't know. This music is terrifying, man. Oh, Squidward, freak! What does he look like? A like a cylinder. You good? You good? Squidward's gone. Oh, okay, six a.m. Game's really cool. Not the best, but it, it's cool. Might as well put night two into this. Hello again. How was your first night? I okay. hope you didn't get Thanks too much trouble. <laughs> um, something I forgot to mention last night. If you've been flicking through your camera feed, uh, you might have noticed oh, that, you know, yeah. The one in the fuse room has a door and a light switch, similar to the ones in your office. Yeah, uh, I If I were that. you, I'd keep an eye on that camera, just to make sure there's no one sneaking around back there. If someone got in, they could do all kinds of nasty stuff to your equipment. Lights could go they? haywire, doors cease to function, it would not be pretty is all I'll say. Wait, what? Oh, oh no. one last thing. Don't ask how, but we discovered something rather interesting about the animatronics today. Uh, sometimes they start behaving oddly, and we'll even simply stare into space. Uh, it's pretty creepy, but we found that flashing a bright light into their eyes will seems to fix any abnormal behavior. So, uh, make sure you keep that in mind. I trust you have your flashlight with you. <laughs> anyway, I've gotta get going. I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Have a good night. Okay. It's already 1am. That was very quick. Get this SpongeBob. He's there. Patrick's in the bathroom. What the freak? What the freak? Somebody's in the fuse room. Sandy? Bro, how am I supposed to know when she comes? She's checking my flashlight. Oh no. She left her. Oh, she's, she's not Foxy? She's.
restaurant's already made back its cost with interest, so I'm sure he's happy about that. By the way, have you seen his animatronic around? The thing seems to lurk around the left side of the restaurant during the day. Um, I'm not sure where he might be during the night, but, you know, I'd keep an eye out for him by the left stairs. I'll be honest, the initial excitement of working with robots is sort of worn off. They're actually starting to creep me out a little. <laughs> but I've said too much. 
I'm sure there are no trouble at night. Anyway, I'll call you again tomorrow, but, you know, only if I need to let you know something. Have a good night. Okay, so there's something new left stairs. I think it's Mr. Krabs, but fortunately, guys, we're going to have to end it here. Um, be sure to hit that like button. It helps out a lot. And subscribe today to join, to join us, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.